is worthy to be praised. No one like our God, ancient of days, Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the ending, the one who is, the one who was, the one who is to come, ancient of days, bless you. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus.
but the mercy of God has kept you. Yes, when the battle of life came, God has made you to you stand. God has turned you against the battle of life. When the enemy wake you up, God fought. You to appreciate God for fighting your battle. Santali Bradyandu Kasodia. We thank God this morning for his faithfulness over our life for yet another morning, day five of these seven days, praise and thanksgiving. We bless his name because he's worthy of our thanks. I want somebody to begin to appreciate God and begin to bless his name. That God, I thank you for the gift of life. Thank you for your love over my life, my family. Thank God for your children, for your wife, for your husband. For everything, for the living and non living things, in everything you have. Begin to thank God, begin to appreciate Him. That God will thank you for how far you have helped us. For, for Ikato, you have helped us. Begin to say, Lord, I thank you. Say, Jesus, I thank you. Alpha and the Omega. Begin to call Him names. Begin to appreciate Him. Begin to call Him names. Begin to call Him names. Ancient of days, the Lord of Lords, the King of Kings, the one who is, the one who was, the one who is to come. Ancient of days. Lord will bless you this morning. Thank you for the gift of life. Thank you for your love. Thank you for being there. Thank you for being, thank you for faithfulness. Lord, we thank you this morning. We bless you this morning. We appreciate you this morning. Begin to bless him. Begin to appreciate him this morning. Begin to bless his name. We, in Jesus' name, we give thanks. Amen. This morning, we are praising God for those things that is yet to be done in our life. Maybe you are looking for the for work and work is not forthcoming. You are pray, pray. Work is not forthcoming. Praise God for it tonight. That God, I thank you, you have done it. You are looking for the fruit of the womb. There's nothing you have not done. You have prayed, you have fasted, you have sowed a seed, and you are you are not you are not being, being pregnant. Please switch to praise. Leave prayer now. Switch to praise. Praise him. Begin to thank him for it. God bless you every your way for joining me this morning. Sweet God, God, I thank you because you have given me the fruit of the womb I'm looking for. Begin to, if you are looking for husband, you're looking for children, begin to thank God for them now. That God, I thank you. Maybe your business is not moving very well. Thank God over that business. Thank God over that career. Thank God. Thank God over your life. Thank God for, for your journey. Maybe nothing is working in your life. Thank God that God, I thank you because you are going to make things work. Begin to thank God. Thank God. Do the opposite of what devil wants to do. Do the opposite of what the Satan wants you to be doing. That he Satan wants you to cry, begin to laugh. Satan wants to complain. Begin to be, begin to be, begin to thank God this morning. And I pray that God will answer your prayer this morning as we give thanks to him in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Thank God for forgiveness of sins. 
that when you fell, he took you up, he dusted you, he brought you up. Thank him for everything he's been doing in your life. Thank him for his love. Thank him for his faithfulness. Because he's God. Thank you for sun. Thank you for moon. Thank you for rain. Thank you, thank, thank you for everything. Thank you for going out and you're coming in. Because God has been the one who has been securing you, who has been protecting you, providing for you, and helping you. When there was nobody to help you, thank him. When people gather against you to, 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 to molest you, to reproach you, God was there fighting your battle. Thank him for all those benefits you have endured. Thank you for daily benefits. Thank you for year, year after year. Eh? We like begin to appreciate him. Lord, we thank you for everything. Thank you, Lord. Lord, from from Amu Apewa, or Gao Bugbalaroi, Olu Agbai Bokpewa. Lord, take this and serve the sacrifice of our thanksgiving and praise this morning, Lord. Lord, let the sacrifices of and our praise be acceptable in your sight this morning. Lord, we have nothing to give you than to say thank you. That, that to say thank you, thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name, we give thanks. Amen. So let this year, 2021, be a year that our thanksgiving should be more than our complaint. This year, beloved, let your thanksgiving be more than your complaint. What are you complaining about? Instead of you complaining, give thanks to God concerning them. This year, let your thanksgiving be more than your complaint. And as you are doing so, God will do those things that is yet to be done in your life in the name of Jesus. Your life now is a prayer request for somebody. Can you say, why must you give thanks and not complain this year? Because your present life now is a prayer point for somebody. Your present life, maybe you are in Nigeria, you say you do have anything. Some people, Maybe you have a house, no bed. Some people are looking for a house. They don't have for bed. Eh? They're looking for a house. They don't have a bed. So your present life, your present position is somebody's future prayer request. That God, take me to where you have taken this person to. So give thanks to God for that. Your present position is prayer, is prayer, is somebody's prayer request. Your life now is somebody's prayer request. And your current position is somebody's future expectation. Your current position is somebody's future expectation. That in the future, I want to get to where this person gets to. And you, you are already there. And you are complaining that where am I here? So your, 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 your current position is somebody's future expectation. So give, give, give God thanks. Your life now is somebody's prayer request. Give thanks. Give thanks. Maybe you are married, no child, no issue. Many people are still looking for marriage. Are they your 45? Are they your 50? No, no, no marriage. Talk less of having issue. So your present position is somebody's future expectation. Your life now is somebody's prayer request. And as you are doing this, I pray that God will do those things that is yet to be done in your life in the name of Jesus. So anything you celebrated, multiply. Can you If you celebrate that 20 naira in your hands, it will multiply. You are complaining about your salary. Celebrate that salary, that small salary. You are complaining about, your, about, about the profit you are making your business. Celebrate that little profit. You are complaining about your husband. Celebrate your husband. You are complaining. If anything you are complaining, it will diminish. But anything you celebrated, multiply. Anything you, 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 you despise, diminish. If you don't want to diminish in life, please appreciate the present condition you are. Maybe you are living in a room today. If you can bless God for it, it will take you to flat. It will even give you your, the house of your home. Maybe you are living in a flat today. Appreciate God for that position. It will take you to your own house. So whatever you celebrated, multiply. So celebrate your present condition, your present position now. Don't complain. Don't murmur. Just appreciate him. Because our God is worthy. And he can turn things around overnight. So I was complaining. And God said, I really don't complain. Go and give me 10 for 7 days. I was saying, God, I will be clocking this also age on Friday. Why, 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 why this? Why that? He said, shut up. Don't complain. Go and give me praise. That's why I declare these 7 days praise. To bless him. To appreciate him for my life. 
kaboli ya ndiki satia koma sonte liga do mukusha tafalia so appreciation is the is the vehicle for acceleration appreciation is the vehicle for acceleration if you want to accelerate in life you want your life to move forward be thanking god be appreciating god carry beside there be appreciating god appreciate appreciation is the vehicle for acceleration and there are wonders we can see in praising and thanking god i'm just telling you the key talks that god told me about praise and thanksgiving so gratitude is the gratitude is the lift to great altitude gratitude is the lift to great altitude in life if you want to go to great altitude in life just show god gratitude that you, that, that, that you are grateful gratitude is the lift for great altitude to, to see what god will do you must acknowledge what he has done to see the next thing the next move of god in your life for god to take you to the next phase of your life you must appreciate him for those things he has done for you in the past just because you don't have a lot doesn't mean you don't have a lot to be thankful for just because you don't have a lot it doesn't mean you don't have a lot to be thankful for if you are thoughtful enough you will be thankful if you are thoughtful enough you will be thankful just because you don't have a lot doesn't mean you don't have a lot to be thankful for if you are thoughtful enough you will be thankful think about your life think about how, where you where, where you are born think about how you came to lagos only you came but now you are married with children god has increased you thank him for that don't complain. Think about when you get to outside Nigeria. Think about the, your, your level there. Think about the level you are now. Thank him for, for what he has done for you in the past. So that he can do the remaining for you. So Thanksgiving. You can be thankful and not give. Thanksgiving. Thanks and giving. Thanks and giving. So when you are thanking God, you give as well. You, you can't be thankful and not giving. And as you are giving this money, as I give him thanks this morning, I pray that God will accept your thanksgiving and your praise in the name of Jesus. So be grateful for how far you have come, not worry where your mates are. This is very, very important. Be grateful for how far you have come, not worry where your mates are. Not worry for where your mates are. Be grateful for how far you have come, how far the Lord has helped you not worry where your mates are if you want to know where your mates are many of your mates they are emotionally many of your mates they are, they, they, they are in hospital many of your mates they are no more to, to they are no more today many of your colleagues they, they have died so be grateful for how far the lord has brought you don't worry where your mates are don't worry about their level Lord, we are grateful this morning. We are grateful, Lord, for how far we have come, for how far you've brought us. Lord, we bless you. Let's look at the book of Psalm 92, from verse 1 to 5. That's where I'm talking this morning. Psalm 92, verse 1 to, verse 1 to 5. It says, It is a good thing to give thanks unto the Lord, and to sing praises unto the name of the most of, 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 of most high, to show forth thy loving kindness in the morning. So that we are early in the morning to show forth your loving kindness in the morning. I see that, and thy faithfulness every night upon an instrument of ten strings and upon the sanctuary, upon the harp with a solemn sounding, with a solemn sound. For thou, Lord, has made me glad through thy works. I will triumph in the works of thy hand. O Lord, how great are thy works! And thy thoughts are very deep. That's that. He said, Oh, we let my fear perform a lua at Latima Corinthian or Rucore or Gaugo, Latima fee show in fair air, new world at two to any and Lara only low, no comewa, and Lara only low, Mimo, Lara. 
duru pelu iro ti o ni iro nu nitori iwo oluwa ni o ti mu mi yo nipa ise re emi o ma korin yin nitori ise owo re oluwa ise re ti tobi to iro inu re jile gidi gidi i see that the work of the lord is so great and his thoughts is so massive so the wonders of praise what are the wonders in praise quickly this morning before we go back to praise god i want to quickly look at the wonders in praise when you praise god there are many wonders that god will give you what are those wonders that we can see in our praise number one praise breaks down barriers and creates openings number one wonders you can type it down please let me type it number one wonders of praise the wonders of praise number one wonders praise breaks down barriers and create openings when you praise god barriers will be broken down and there shall be a new opening i pray for somebody watching me this morning as you join me in this place as you are praising god every barriers on your way shall break down god will break every barrier and open a new door for you and open a new way for you there shall be a new openness a new openness a new openness a new openness for you so praise breaks down barriers and create a new openness god will create a new way where there is no way for you before in the book of Psalm 114, from verse 1 to 10, Psalm 114, it said, When Israelites came out of Egypt, and the people of the opposition of Israel, uh, the people of Israel, out of a strange language, do that was essentially, the sea saw him and fled. The, the, the mountain was skipped like a ram. What a lady, hold that mountain that you skip like a ram. He said, he said, tribal, oh heads. When when they when they enter, when they enter their land. The mountain began to give way. The barriers began to give way. The sea be, that, 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 that posed in itself as a barrier on their way give way for them to pass. Every barrier, every evil sea, every evil mountain placed on your way shall give way this morning. Every barriers on your way shall give way for you this morning. You will pass. You will move forward. You will move forward. You will move forward. You will move forward. You will move forward, will move forward. in the name of Jesus. So praise breaks down barriers and creates openness and joshua 6 20 joshua 6 20 said the mountain the, the and when the priest took the trumpet they blew the trumpet and the wall of jericho fell down flat after the shouting of seven hallelujah after they surrounded the the, the wall seven times they were praising God. They, they saw barriers. They saw mountains. They saw they, they saw hindrances on uh, in, 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 on their way. But instead of them to be crying, they were praising God. They were blowing trumpets. They were saying thank you, Jesus. And as they are doing that, barriers collapsed. Uh, war collapsed. As we are thanking God this morning, every barriers on your way shall collapse. Every evil red sea shall be dried up by fire. Kalibo Sitori Masaida. So praise is so potent. There are wonders you can see in praise and thanksgiving. And number one wonders that praise causes, praise breaks down barriers and creates open. Number two, praise causes God to step in into life's battles and take them over. Praise causes God to step in into your battle and take it over. Praise causes God. Number two wonders you can see, praise makes God to step in into the battle of your life and take over the battle and you know when god steps in he will take over and when god takes over the battle the battle is over so as you are praising god this morning your battle shall be over your battle is over the battle of your life is over forever in the name of jesus so praise number two one that you can see praise causes god to step in into life battles and take over the battle so as you are praising god this morning as I got him in this seven days praise and thanksgiving, God is stepping into the battle of your life and is taking it over. I don't know the battle you are going through. Maybe monetary battle, financial battle, ministerial battle, career battle, maybe, maybe business battle. God will step in this morning and take over. We can see that in the book of 2 Chronicles chapter 20, verse 22. 2 Chronicles 2022. Jehoshaphat was fighting three kings, and as he was praising God, God stepped in into that battle and took over the battle and fought for them. Jehoshaphat did not fight at all; it was God that was fighting for them. I see that God fought for them. 
and conquer the battle for them. The Lord will fight for you and conquer the battle for you this morning in the name of Jesus. So number three, number three, wonders of praise. Praise imparts supernatural might and strength into the life of the saint. Praise imparts supernatural might and strength into the life of the praiser. You can see when you are hungry before, when you are weak before, but when you begin to listen to music, you begin to, you begin to praise God, you just see that the strength will come from nowhere. So praise used to impart supernatural might and strength. Are you weak? I, I, did you, did, I, have you lost your strength? Are, are you feeling you, you, you cannot go forward again? Are you discouraged? Are you frustrated? Praise we impart you with a might and strength to forge ahead in your life, in your career, in your destiny, in your visions, in your dreams, in life, this morning, in the name of Jesus. So praise imparts supernatural strength and might into the life of the saint. Nehemiah 8.10 Nehemiah 8.10 says, The joy of the Lord is our strength. The joy of the Lord is our strength. The joy of the Lord shall be your strength. Maybe the enemy has brought sadness into your life. The sadness will weak you. It will weaken your, your strength. It will weaken your mind. But the only thing that can make you to, to have strength is the joy. And you can get this joy by praising God. By appreciating God. And the joy of the Lord that you have now received through praise will now be your strength. And strength, you need strength to run the race of destiny. You need might, you need strength to fulfill destiny. You need strength to do whatever you want to do. I pray for somebody this morning, God will supply you with a new strength. Receive strength, receive strength, receive might, receive supernatural strength, receive supernatural might, receive supernatural strength, receive supernatural might to move forward, to forge ahead in your life journey. Our rubber side there. Proverbs 24 10. He said, If thou if thou weak in the day of adversity, your strength is small. <laughs> if thou faint in the day of adversity, your strength is small. In the book of Proverbs 24, verse 10. If thou faint, if thou discourage in the day of adversity, your strength is small. And so if you want to increase your strength, you need the joy of the Lord. And if you want to get the joy of the Lord, you need to be thankful and to be praiseful. That's just analogy. And the Lord will supply you with joy and strength and might shall be available unto you this morning in the name of Jesus. And what is the next wonders of praise? I told you, I said, wonders of praise. I said, number one, praise breaks down barriers and creates openings. Number two, praise causes God to step in into life's battles and take over. Number three, praise imparts supernatural might and strength into the life of the saints. And number four, praise establishes the presence and the anointing of God upon the life of the saints. Praise establishes the presence and the anointing of God upon the life of the saints praise when you are praising god it will make god's presence to be available for you god himself will come down to list what you want to say so praise make god to, to make his presence to come down and releases his anointing upon you we can see that in the book of psalm 22 verse 3 psalm 22 verse 3 said thou art holy O thou that dwells in the praises of Israel, God in dwell, God dwells in our praise. And I told you, I said, when you pray, God send an angel to you. But when you praise God, He Himself will come down in His glory to answer your prayer. And as we are praising God this morning, God will come down in His glory and answer your prayers in the name of Jesus. Carry beside them, Malebro Sekoli beside them. Second Chronicles chapter 5, verse 13 to 14. Second Chronicles chapter 5, verse 13 to 14. Caliber side. Hallelujah this morning. Mm. 
Solomon was praising God and the glory of God came down to the extent that the priests could not do their priestly work again because the glory of God has filled the temple. There was smoke everywhere because it was praising God. So as you praise God this morning, the glory of God will come down upon you in that name. So, so the last one, the number five of the wonders of praise. Number five of the wonders of praise, praise put situations and systems under prayer to release what has been held captive. Oh, I love this one. Praise put situations and systems under prayers to release what has been held captive. I pray for somebody this morning as we are praising God. Situations and systems shall be put under prayer to release unto you what has been held captive in your life in the name of Jesus. Whatever the devil and the enemy has held captive in your life, God will release them for you. Your praise shall release them for you this morning in the name of Jesus. So praise, put situations and systems under prayer to release what has been held captive. In the book of Psalm 67 verse 5 to 7, it said, Let the people praise thee, O Lord. Let the people praise thee. So our land shall yield and increase. It said, God, even our own God, will bless us. God, even our own God, will bless us. All your blessing that has been held captive, as we praise God this morning, shall be released. Shall be released for you. It shall be released for you. It shall be released for you. Those blessings that the kingdom of the devil had held captive, those blessings, those things that are supposed to have acquired, you're supposed to have attained, you're supposed to have possessed, that the kingdom of the enemy has held captive, as we praise God in these seven days, I pray it shall be released under prayer. I put them under prayer. Shall be released now. It shall be released now. Shall be released for you now. It shall be released for you now. May God release them for you by fire. In the name of Jesus. So I pray for you this morning as you praise God. In the book of Psalm 86 verse 17. He said, show me a token for good that my enemy may see and be ashamed. As your praise this morning. We show you a token. We make God to show you a token for good in the name of Jesus. Your praise this morning. We make God to show you a token for good in the name of Jesus. Your praise this morning. We make God to show you a token for good in the name of Jesus. God bless you, my pastor. Pastor again. He said, Show me a token for good. Your praise this morning will make God to show you a token for good in the name of Jesus. As you praise God this morning, what I heard, the Lord said, as you, as you praise me this morning, I will destroy that stumbling yoke, that stubborn yoke in your life. Every stubborn yoke in your life shall be destroyed in the name of Jesus. As you praise God this morning, every stubborn yoke in your life shall be destroyed. Every stubborn yoke in your family shall be destroyed. As you are praising God this morning, as you are praising God with me this week, every stubborn yoke in your family, in your marriage, in your business, in your career, in your foundation shall be destroyed. Your praise will destroy stubborn yoke this morning. I pray for somebody, 2 Timothy chapter 4, verse, verse 18. Second Timothy chapter 4, verse 18. He said, I will deliver you from every evil works of the enemy. I will deliver you from every evil works of the enemy. I pray for somebody listening this morning. As you are praising God this morning, the Lord will deliver you from every evil works of the enemies in the name of Jesus. Jehovah God will deliver you this morning from all the evil works of the enemy against your family, against your children, against your children, against your husband, against your wife in the name of Jesus. First Timothy. 2 Timothy chapter 4 verse 18. He said, I will deliver you from every evil works of the devil. Your praise this morning will make God to deliver you from every evil works of the enemy. I pray for somebody watching me. As for praising God this morning, all the evil works, all the completed works of the enemy, the Lord will deliver you and your family from them. In the name of Jesus. 
every evil works of the devil this year for you the lord will deliver your family from those evil works in the name of jesus hear what i heard now because you have praised God this morning. The Lord said, I will make the hand that is bigger than you, that is stronger than you, to help you, to lift you up. A mighty hand of God, the hand of Epa, that is stronger than your hand, stronger than your hand, bigger than your hand, shall help you shall help your life this year. As you are praising God this morning, the hand of air pass of destiny that is stronger than you, that is bigger than you, shall lift you up, shall help you in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. Yeah, what Lord says, because you praise me this morning, I will break every circular battle in your life. I'm breaking every circular battles in your life because you have praised me this morning. I will break every circular battle. This the, the battle that that that, that, that I've been a circular, I've been a seasonal, seasonal yearly battle, seasonal battle in your family, in your life. I will break that circular battles in your life. Every circular battle shall be broken this morning in the name of Jesus. I break every circular battle in your life. Because you praise God this morning, I pray that every circular battle shall be broken. Circular battle, yearly battle, seasonal battle in your life shall be broken. I break it now. Begin to pray, Lord, because I praise you this morning, break every circular battle, break every yearly battle, every monthly cry. Let it break. Let it be over. Let it be terminated. Let it be over. Let it be over now. In the name of Jesus. Here the last one that I heard. Lord said, because you praise me this morning, I will do for you what you cannot do for yourself. I will do for you what you can't do for yourself. God, somebody is watching me this morning. Because you have, you have praised God this morning, God will do for you what your strength cannot do for yourself. What you can do for yourself, the, 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 your praise this morning, we make God to do for you what you can do for yourself. That, 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 that the point that God, that, God, that God told me, he said, tell them, because they praise me this morning, I will do for them what they can do for themselves. He said, I'm going to break every circular battle, every seasonal battle in their life. He said, I will make the hand that is, the hand of air power that is stronger than them to lift them up. Now say, I will deliver them from the, all the evil works of the enemy. He said, I will destroy that stubborn yoke in their life and family. And say, I will show them a token for good because they have praised me. And all these blessings, all this promise of God shall be your portion. This do today, this week, this month, this year. In the name of Jesus. Kalebo Centoria. Marie Kapolia Gadabuku Centoria. Lee Kapo Centoria. Because you have praised God this morning. I pray God will show you a token for good. Because you have praised God this morning. I pray God will destroy that stubborn yoke in your life. Because you have praised God this morning. God will deliver you from every evil words of the enemy. Because you have praised God this morning, God will break that circular battle, that is not sickness in your life. Because you have praised God this morning, God will do for you what you can do for yourself in the name of Jesus. And you shall rejoice all, 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 all the rest of your life. You will not cry anymore. You will not cry again. Joy and rejoicing shall be your portion. Joy and rejoicing shall be your portion in the name of Jesus. So the wonders of praise. And we are going to see all these wonders in your life. All these wonders shall be your portion. And God will help you. So let's begin to appreciate God. Lord, I thank you for what you are here to do in my life. Begin to bless now. 
begin to thank him now we are coming to the end of the, pro, of, the of the message begin to say thank you thank you jesus thank you for what for, for you are going to do thank you because you are going to deliver me from all the evil works of the enemy thank you because you are going to show me a token for good thank you lord because you are going to you are, you are going to break every stubborn yoke in my life thank you because you are going to do what i can't do for myself Thank you because you are going to destroy all the evil works of the enemy in my life and family. This morning, as I've praised you, Lord, I praise you for all these your promises. Thank you because you are, your presence shall abide with me. Thank you because you are going to step in into my battle and take over. I am going to make the battle of my life to be over. Thank you because you are going to break barriers and give me a new openings. Thank you because you are going to break every barriers and give me a new opening. Thank you because you are going to give me might, supernatural might and strength. That is the, that, those are the wonders of praise. Thank you because you are going to supply me with supernatural strength and might. Begin to bless. Begin to bless God. Begin to praise His name. Begin to praise Him now. Begin to thank Him now. Thank Thank you for supernatural strength and mind that I'm going to enjoy through the praise of this morning. Thank you, my Father. Thank you, Abba Father. Thank you, Abba Father. Thank you, Abba Father. Thank you, ancient of days. Lord, I bless you. Lord, I worship you. Lord, I give you praise. No one like you. No one can be compared to you. Alpha and Omega, I thank you. I thank you. I thank you. Thank you, Lord, because you are going to put situations and systems under prayer to release what has been held captive concerning my life. Thank you because whatever the enemy has held captives against my life shall be released. You are going to put situations and systems under prayer to release what has been held captive against my life. What has been held captive from me? Anything, all your properties, all your blessings, all your glory, all your virtues that the enemy has held captive. God will put them under prayer. God will put those who edit captives under prayer to release them unto you this morning in the name of Jesus. Situations and systems shall be put under prayer to release unto you what has been head captives. Thank you, mighty Father, for what I'm going to do. Thank you because I've done it. Mali Kaponde Legadwaba. Maybe your money is being captive. Maybe your job, maybe your employment is being held captive. Begin to thank God because it has been released. It has been released. Every, every way, try and share this video. Try and share this video and make a watch party with it. Help us to share it to, to your groups. Malika Pondi Kantali Mokoria. Yege de Gebo Squara. Let up. Posote Yegedea. Leke Borosoto. Thank you, mighty father. Thank you, mighty father. Thank you, mighty father. Lord, I worship you. I give you praise, Lord. 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 Lord, I thank you for how far I've come. I'm not worried about where my mates are. Thank you, ancient of this, this morning. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. We have come to the end of the program this morning. We thank God for how far God has helped us. And I know you have been blessed this morning without any shadow of doubt. I know God has taught you and God has blessed you. I myself have been blessed through the message and through all what we have done this morning. And I know what God will always be giving you what we cause to be celebrating, to celebrate in the name of Jesus. And those things that God is here to do that you have given him thanks for this morning, before the end of this month, it shall become a testimony in your hands. It shall become a testimony in your hands. Those, those type, those praise points. You have turned your challenges to praise points this morning. You have turned what you are passing to praise points this morning. Those things you have turned to praise points, you are coming back to praise God concerning them. You are coming back to share the testimony on this platform that God has finally done it for you. And so shall it be for you. In the name of Jesus. This year is blessed. This week is blessed. Today is, the, is, 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 is when I say the day of mercy. Mercy of God. We see you through the journey of your life. In the name of Jesus. God will assist you. You will not lack. You will not suffer. You will not die. You will not, you will not be reproached. You will not be disgraced. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I've told you, Friday, two days, is it two days to this time, it's my birthday. And we thank God, it's this is the main two days, it's day five. Tomorrow shall be day six. And Friday, the final day, shall be the seven. So tomorrow, 6 a.m. in the morning, try and join us. I will continue in our, in, in, in our praise and thanksgiving. So, thanksgiving, many people don't know, it's not prayer. Thanksgiving is so important. God uses it a lot to help us. 
So try and cultivate the attitude of, of thanking God. Don't complain. Don't murmur. Don't worry. Don't 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 commit suicide. Just give God thanks. If you have prayed and it's as if prayer is doing it gradually, thanksgiving and praise will do it for you suddenly. We do it for you suddenly. Prayer may do it gradually, but praise we do it suddenly. And when we praise God, when praise go up, God comes down. And God has come down this morning and his presence shall forever be with you and your family in the name of Jesus. Everything that is yet to be done in your life shall be done and God will show himself mighty concerning you and your household in the name of Jesus. Bless you. Uh, I told you, you can be thankful. Th thanksgiving. Thanks and giving. Thanks and giving. When you say thanksgiving, you must give. For your thanksgiving to be meaningful. I want everybody to package something to appreciate God. Package God to appreciate, package something to appreciate God. Thanks and giving. So look for something you can give to appreciate God. You can show it to, to, into the account of this ministry that, that you see there. You can show it to the account of this ministry. And after doing so, God will bless you in the name of Jesus. And your thanksgiving, your sacrifice of thanksgiving shall be acceptable. Thanksgiving is a sacrifice. And as we are presenting sacrifice to God, God will accept our sacrifices and help us and deliver us and do for us what we can do for ourselves. This is it, in the name of Jesus. You are next in line for testimony. You are next in line for miracle. You are next in line to be celebrated in the name of Jesus. And God will assist you. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. See you tomorrow. God bless you. Help us to share that video. Bye. See you on top.